Yo, hello everyone! Today we have a pretty simple video idea suggested by a viewer where we will play a deck which consists of our highest masteries, so those first eight you can see right now will be our deck basically, and this is it. Pretty simple idea as I said already, if you have other challenges you want to suggest me, maybe more difficult ones, as I said already in the past, in the past few videos, <clears throat> maybe challenges where I actually struggle to even win one game, Make sure to leave it in the comments, and I will see you in the first game. We are in this first game against Moo. Um, I think our deck is not the worst. We have three, sp three spells, two win conditions, but you know, we have mini P.E.K.K.A. Goblins, so... I must say... I I'm just trying to, re to understand if I'm playing on the correct account, because I, I didn't think that uh, people would arrow my tower in League 8, J just saying. Okay, our opponent goes for Musketeer, so let's go for Balloon in the other lane, hopefully we can punish him for that, because he played so aggressive. Uh, I will lock that instead of Goblins, because I want to keep... Oh my god, he would have Nado. Um, so yeah, we basically didn't punish him at all. He has King Tower on, we dealt almost no damage, because he had Barb's Nado freak this guy. Um, he will probably go for Hog Rider pretty soon, if I had to guess. I'm still trying to understand why why he would arrow my... Um, my tower just like that, it doesn't make any sense, but all right. Oh wait, he didn't have Hog Rider, he had fucking Balloon, why did I forget? So we are losing the tower, nice. And what is this guy doing? I don't understand. Okay, he nadoed, that's great. Maybe we can punish him for that. I don't know, I'm, I'm trying to understand if we can actually punish our opponent for any plague he makes. Okay, I think this should, should be two shots, please. <laughs> Obviously it's not, why would it? Please don't have barbs yet. Please, he shouldn't have 5 elixir. Okay, he was at 4. Two hog rider shots. This is not great. This is not great whatsoever. Let's try going for a log. Um, mini P.E.K.K.A. Fireball the Mother Witch. Alright, he goes for Musk. Uh, let's go for Goblins behind that mini P.E.K.K.A. Okay, he splits barbs, which is fine. He goes for that, still fine. Let's go for Hogra. They're from the back. I, oh my god. Why? Why would you have freeze as well? You already have arrows and NATO. What is wrong with this guy? Please, Hog Rider, take the tower. Okay, 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 okay. Arrow that. Th this could be two shots, maybe. <laughs> yeah, obviously it's not. <laughs> Why would it be? Um, Baby D gonna put in some nice work there. Hopefully. He will fireball. I mean, he will freeze. So we need to do something. Oh my god. Luckily he didn't get a shot. Arrows don't do enough, I think. Log that. Please. Oh my god, please. Fireball, 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 fireball. Please don't mask in the pocket. Please don't mask in the pocket. Why did it have to be so close? I don't understand. It's, it's not supposed to be so close when playing against someone that arrows your tower first play, basically. Um, okay, it's fine. Let, let's keep going, pretending nothing happened. We are against Zaki Boy. Uh, <laughs> we won the first game, so that's great, but it's not looking great. Like, as I said already at the beginning, the deck is not that bad, but, you know, playing Hog Rider Balloon Triple Spell is also not the best thing in the world. Um, hopefully it's not... No, no, why did I go for Hog Rider? He will just activate King Tower. Oh my god, he messed up. Suck it. 
okay let's go for mini pekka he may go for graveyard here not sure if this would be the play just log that um he doesn't have okay uh let's go for balloon like that he will ice weed so we can fireball it oh that's a really interesting ice weeds for sure i was expecting him to ice weeds in another placement instead he just why so aggressive i don't understand people just go for goblins mini pekka as well i think it's needed and he may activate king tower here okay no he doesn't okay um that's not a great matchup in any way whatsoever. We cannot go Hog Rider because he will just activate King Tower. Um, let's go for Balloon, I guess. I just don't want him to activate King Tower for free or with Tower Balloon. And he would have done it if we didn't play the fireball there, I think. Let's go for Hawk Rider now. I think it will be hard for him to activate King Tower now because the Skeleton King is in the way. Okay, he takes the shot. Great. Uh, I don't care about that thing in the other side, to be fair. Let's go for something like that. Um, late log, I guess. Okay, we are fine. Like, unfortunately, our thing there died. Oh no, we played the Hog Rider right into the thing. I was saying the whole game we cannot activate the King Tower. And we, are, we did right now. So, that's not great. Let's go for Goblins, Balloon. Uh, he will Ice Weeds most probably. Let's Fireball. We can't really do much else. We still get Death Damage, which is more than enough for me. Um, maybe dragon, maybe. Uh, it goes in the other lane, which is great for us. Let's go for mini Pekka, Hog Rider, Arrows. He messed up, but but having a uh, tombstone log is just so good for him. Let's go for another BBD. Let's just log that. Um, let's go for a Hog Rider as well, I guess. Arrow... We didn't hit the tower, unfortunately. We are getting kind of a comeback here, though. We need to do something like that, though. Can't really let the baby decross. Okay. Um, let's go for... Not that, that's not what I wanted to do. He's, he keeps messing up the placements, which is kind of funny. Alright, we get almost a Hog Rider connection. We need to pressure right now. Oh, no, 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 the barb got a shot. No, that's where we lose. We need to spell cycle, do something. We, we have to do something. Hog Rider, maybe? No, please, something? Uh, fireball, Hog Rider, Arrows. No, wait, we didn't hit the arrows. We, we miss, we missed the, the arrows like three times, I think. I don't understand, like the range of the arrows is just so messed up. We actually lost. It was so close as well. Like it was such a bad matchup and we almost got the win. I truly don't understand. Like, you see, the arrows basically... He, I mean, here it doesn't look like... Why was it? It looked like the arrow hit the tower, but they actually don't. Ugh, freak this game. Alright, so here we are in the third, or better say, the fourth game. Because the third one was interrupted abruptly by my granddad playing the saxophone, which is just a detail, you know, things that happen every day. You wanted to record. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys, we go for the arrows here. <laughs>
Let's go. Let's go. Go for a grinder. <laughs> All right. Now we are against Shrek as Amor. Uh, I'm really happy about playing against Shrek as Amor right now. Uh, Phoenix is not something I love to see. And he's probably playing RG. Luckily, we have Mini Pekka, which will be able to put in some work. Uh, he'll play Fisherman. Yep, here it is. Luckily, the Mini Pekka was quick enough at dealing with the RG. So it was actually a really bad Fisherman, in my opinion. Nice. Everything is dead. Great stuff. Let's pressure with the Hog Rider now. He doesn't have the Fisherman in cycle, so we'll have to play a, like a Phoenix or something, which is not great. Musketeer, okay. Uh, this will be so much damage though. Yes, let's go. Let's log everything back. Um, he just didn't really play the best. That's something I don't care about. That spirit there. Let's go for goblins. Probably kind of useless. Probably it was better to keep them for... To distract the fisherman and protect the mini P.E.K.K.A. Because that, that's what he will do right now. The Mini P.E.K.K.A. should still be able to get two shots on that. Yeah, he just played a really bad RG once again. I don't understand why he's playing it that way. Like, the, the, the Fisherman just so far away, it doesn't even kite. I think he's not really experienced with playing RG, at least that's how it looks like. Like, even playing um, Evo RG doesn't save this guy. That's just a log, not gonna do much else. Um, the Balloon will not get a connection, I fear. Yeah, because he has the Musketeer, I just completely forgot. Usually, um, you don't face RG players with Musketeer. I mean, here he played really well. No, can't really say anything about that. Yeah, yeah he, he just played really well here. Um, <laughs> I can't really say anything wrong about it. Uh, let's go for Hog Rider. Yeah, that's tough. Uh, we are losing the tower here. Uh, that That's not great. Oh, Evo RG, man. Not played that much anymore, but still fucking annoying. No, that log was so perfect, and I hate it for that. He'll just go for fucking... RG in the pocket. Yeah. <sighs> I hate this so much. Like, truly hate it so much. He didn't even play well. And he BMs. How can you BM when you played like shit? You played like garbage. I hate it so much. Only because he had Evolution RG and everything else in between. He would play also Phoenix with Musketeer just to, to, to be annoying with my balloon. Uh, let's play one last game. I guess, uh, just to compensate the mess with the third game not, not not being completed, let's just say, as it should have. Mega Knight from the back, second play, you love to see that as well. I have no clue how we're gonna stop that. Like, truly, I have no clue. Oh my god, we messed up. Um, the only thing we can do is play a really late log and just lose all the tower on the right side because we don't have anything against the bandit. I guess it's a fair trade. <laughs> oh my god, people in those arenas doing the most dumb stuff and getting away with it. I can't. I need to play decent decks because I feel shit losing against these people by not having a decent deck. It's starting to piss me off. And he goes for Mega Knight from the back once again. Uh, let's go for Hog Rider, I guess. He will play uh, Prince again, but this time we have the Baby Dragon, which will actually deal more or less with the Prince, so we should be fine. Let's just go for Logo Blins. Arrow that. 
Prince got two shots and he's gonna go bend it on the bridge again and we don't have anything for it. <gasps> Frick! <laughs> we just don't have enough ground troops. <laughs> we can't do anything. I, I need to play the mini P.E.K.K.A for the Mega Knight, the Goblins for the, for, for the Prince and I don't have anything else. He just sucks the damage from the baby dragon, which is fair, you know. And he goes for that. Uh, he probably does have Musketeer or something. Here it is. That's Fireball. It's pretty aggressive, I know, but... It doesn't even make me get one shot. I hate this so much. Um, I think we're fine. We defended pretty decently here. Still lost almost the whole time. Why would you have Fireball? People don't run Fireball in this deck. Why? <laughs> He's just gonna Mega Knight. Yeah, fuck this guy. Uh, we hit only one bat. I'm so pissed. We only won two games. One, two. I don't even know, but... Losing against those people, he didn't even do anything crazy, he didn't do any prediction, good play. He was just going for Mega Knight from the back right from the start of the game, Prince in the other lane. And they just didn't have any answers for it. Fuck this deck. I don't like it. Uh, whoever suggested it, freak you. Probably, I, I still love you, so don't, don't worry. Thank you. I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.